What is up, guys? Going down here this morning to check out this yard that's an overgrown yard. Lady called me. I have no idea how tall it's going to be, but she said it's it ain't been cut in quite some time. So we're headed down here to look at it. I'm a little skeptical <laughs> at this point. You might just keep on driving. <laughs> No, we got to cut it. I know. I know. <laughs> so, sorry if it looks a little weird. You're on the GoPro right now. <laughs> They're probably looking at everything back there. Yeah. But, uh, anyways, we're gonna, I'll show it to you when we get down here. So, I think we, we get off here. Dude. We yeah. did. But, uh, yeah. A little skeptical. So, let's check it out. All right, guys. We're here. At the yard, it's bad. <laughs> Look at that. This thing ain't been cut in months. No, waist deep, waist deep. It's not big, but it's not uh, really big. It's just just it's really tall. tall. We're gonna have to run over it like 15 times. The thing of it is, dude, we really gotta watch out for yellow jackets. Walk around here and look. But here's the front yard. I don't know. That's why I want to go back there and see. So, might not be too bad, but the only thing about it is I'm scared of freaking yellow jacket. Look at that, dude. Look at that. God. That crap is tall. Super tall. That's the tallest lawn we've cut this year. Stab me. You talking about yellow jacket. <laughs> You're not allergic, are you? No. Okay. Ah, uh, no. Well, I'm worried about damn dog. There's a little bit of a, a little bit of one. Not here. I'm sure somebody lives next door. Yeah, we'll around this way. Walk around this way. <clears throat> oh yeah, here we go. Jeez, man. This place looks creepy. Looks like a meth house. <laughs> oh yeah. There's not much of a yard. No, it ain't near the front. No. Probably because People next door might have, might be cutting it every now and then. All right, so now here's what we got to worry about. We got to worry about yellow jackets people for one. Shooting people shooting us. Meth heads living in the house. Somebody squatting in the house. Somebody squatting. What's that mean? You never heard of people of squatters? You talking about like living in it? Yeah, people that you don't know who live like homeless people. But. Well, I don't care about that. We're not here to get in the house. Well, I know I'm not leaving. But we got to worry about that and running over crap because we have no idea what the hell's laying down in there. So we have to be extremely careful. Thoughts, Chase? Is that, is that, is that, it? Is that good enough? <laughs>
painted the side of the truck. It's all good. We're gonna wash everything tomorrow and stuff anyway, so. Chase is down there finishing up some blowing. There you go, guys. Doesn't look too good. It's a friggin' mess. I do, do absolutely do not like doing these. For one, uh, it's extremely hard on your equipment. The trimmers, I mean everything. You're working everything a lot harder. Jeez. The only reason why I took this on, I mean guys, the stuff was waist deep and it's thick. Really super thick. Uh, but a long time customer, it's her son's house. He rents it out. He doesn't live in the, ta in the city. Uh, he lives like in Florida or something somewhere. But, uh, you know, she said that the clients that were here or the tenants that were here, you know, hadn't cut the yard in forever and she had just seen it like, you know, a couple weeks ago. And that's that. So it's unfortunate because, you know, she could have called me you know, two months ago, two or three months ago, and said, hey, Adam, you know, will you go cut that yard? I mean, I'd, I'd cut this really cheap for her. You know, it wouldn't cost her that much to come out here every couple weeks and, you know, bust that out. So instead, you know, it cost her 150 bucks to cut this lawn. And it's small, it's tiny, you know. I mean, if me and Chase were, you know, regularly keeping up with this at least every two weeks, hell, we'd be in and out of here in five minutes, five to eight minutes, you know. So it is what it is. But anyways, guys, that's this yard. Touching up a little bit of stuff and let's move on. What's up guys you're uh, looking at the romantic glow off a of cargo light <laughs> so we uh, you know it's pretty dark it's pretty daggum dark we literally just pulled off of a yard got the trailer backed in and all that stuff we'd have been done for about five minutes <laughs> yeah but uh, you know we we really pushed it today with the uh, you know, getting getting the kids from school and all that stuff. So I couldn't see what I was with it a while ago. I couldn't see where I, I was mowing. I, I really don't know what it's gonna look like. What's up? You wanna come in here and get in the vlog with us? No. Come, come here! On, come come here. on! No, I'm good. 
<laughs> We've been a wuss. She's a wuss. My wife, she's scary. She's scared to death of the camera. Camera shy. <laughs> but anyways, guys, uh, yeah, that was today. I hope y'all enjoyed that nice, beautiful yard we got to cut. Because that's the only one that we really pulled a lot of footage off of. So, anyways, comment, rate, and subscribe. This guy's stupid. And as always, keep mowing. Never stop.